Welcome back students to our channel Exact City. So in this section I thought of discussing about some new Q codes which you can expect during May 2023. I am on travel and I didn't get time to sit and shoot this video that's why I am preparing this video like this slides and all. Try to prepare with this and previously also we released one short video related to the newly added cards and in that also I mentioned regarding some cards which they already started to ask. So I will uh, mention that in the description box and frequently asked cards in the entire April month I will release as soon as possible because you can expect that in May month too. So let's start up first card describe a teacher whom you like you need to talk about your favorite teacher when did you meet him or her what is your relationship with him or her what you learned from that person about the subject or if there is any skill means you can talk about that how often do you meet him or her. Okay, so that's regarding the sub question. So you need to talk about your favorite teacher in detail. Second one, describe a modern building. You need to talk about any modern architecture, any contemporary design. So where it is, what it is used for, that means whether it is residential purpose or commercial purpose, why you visited and why you like or dislike about this building. Next one, talk about a traditional story which is well known in your country. So that may be related to any person or any place. Okay, so there are so many uh, stories which we can hear from our ancestors or our grandparents and all related to any particular place. Why that particular name came for that place and like that. So you need to talk about any traditional story which is well known in your country. Why you know this story? How you feel about this story, what the story is about and why this story is well known. Next card, it's very easy. Describe a wild animal from your country. You need to talk about any wild animal. So if you're from India means you can talk about our national animal Bengal tiger. Okay, so what the animal is, what it looks like, where it lives and explain how people in your country feel about this animal. Next one, describe a famous painting or photo you have seen or know about. You watched somewhere, maybe from the great artist or traditional artist of your country or if maybe any modern art or any photo or any painting you seen or know about. What it shows about you need to describe about the picture, what is unusual about it, why it is famous, what is the reason behind that. Say if you would like to hang this picture in your house or not. Next one, talk about a party you want to throw in your future for some special occasion. So it can be for your special person or related to any special event in your life. So who is the party for? What the party is about? Where and when will be the party? And how you feel about it? So you need to talk about a party you want to conduct, you want to throw in the future for any occasion or for any special person. Moving further, talk about something to do to help the environment. You need to talk about something you can do to protect the environment or to save our biodiversity. Like reduce the usage of the private vehicle to avoid the pollution or any other waste disposal management. Avoid the use of plastics. Uh, then promote the natural fertilizers rather than the uh, chemical pesticides and all. Like that so many things, any eco-friendly activity you can talk about. So what you do, how often you do it, why you do it and say how that thing helps the environment. Moving further, describe a leisure center you often go to. Any leisure center you like to spare your time there. Any type of leisure activity that may be meditation, yoga or any sports or games you like to swim means like that centers. So what it is and when you go there, what facilities it has, what you do there and explain why you like this place. Next one, describe your typical day. When you are working or studying, you need to explain about that particular day. What things you do, you need to say about your routine activities, how long you spend doing those things, what the most difficult things you have to do. And see if you usually enjoy those days or not. Next one, talk about a dream you have seen. You need to talk about a dream you have seen in your life. 
scary or happy or any type of dream so when you saw it what the dream was how it affected you and say why you still remember the dream that means any particular thing if it is scary in this sense definitely we will not forget about that after we wake up also so you can just talk about your dream next one talk about the most beautiful natural scenery you have ever seen so you um, not at all seen that type of uh, beautiful natural scenery in your life so where you saw it with whom you went there how did you know about this place that means who suggested or from where you came to know about the place and whether you will suggest this place to someone okay next one talk about something you can do on a computer that you think is enjoyable you like to play games or you like to use any type of software so what equipment or software you need to do that why you need to do that what kind of people it is popular with if it is game in the sense mainly children like that and see if you would like to spend more time doing that or not how long you like to spare for that Next one, describe an occasion when your friends came home. You need to talk about an occasion when your friends visited your home. What occasion was it? Who came home? What you did on the day? And see if you enjoyed the time and how. Next one, talk about a recent traffic that you got into. You just congested in a traffic recently. Where the traffic was, how big the traffic was. When it was and say if you were affected by the delay. So how long it you took uh, to solve the issue and all. Next one, describe a thing you haven't used. You purchased any item or you got any items and till now you didn't try it out. So what it is, when you will use it, why you brought it and say why you haven't used it. So what is the reason behind that? You didn't get time or you uh, after that you just regret about your decision to buy it out. Next one, describe a well-known artist that you admire. Well-known artist, any sector but artist. Okay, so who the artist is, what field the artist working and how you know about the artist and explain why you admire the person about the character or about the work. Next one, describe a voluntary help you received. Any voluntary help you received from someone or any organization. What help it was, who helped you, how it was useful and say if you also like helping someone else. Then the last card, describe a childhood activity you enjoyed the most. You need to talk about any childhood activity that you enjoyed a lot. So the sub question what the activity was, why you liked it, how often you did it and explain how the activity was useful. So try to prepare with these cards and stay tuned for more updates and I will come out with more preparation materials. And I recognize that some channels are just copying our content so try to aware about that too. So stay tuned and God bless you all.